So beautiful question, absolutely delightful question. I had a tough, tough time solving this. And so I have five tender P notes. I had three 20 rupee notes and two 50 rupee notes in my wallet. If three notes were taken out randomly and simultaneously, what are the probability that at least 90 rupees were taken out? To start with, three notes are taken out from this. And so, what could it be? I could have all three as 10 rupee notes. I could have all three as 20 rupee notes. I could not have all three as 50 rupee notes. I could have two tens and a 20. A 10, a 20 and a 50. It's complicated. So I need to have a method to do this. Right? So I'm going to say, I have 10 rupee notes into 5. 20 rupee notes into 3. And 50 rupee notes into 2. Right? What could I be selecting out of these? I could have 10, 10, 10, all three tens, or I could have two tens, or I could have one ten, or I could have zero tens. So I could have two tens, that means 10, 10, 20, or 10, 10, 50, or only one ten. So 10, 20, 20, 10, 50, 50, or 10, 20, 50. So three tens. 2 tens and 1 other note, 1 ten and 2 other notes, 2 other notes could be both 20, both 15 or 0 tens in which case I could have 20, 20, 20 or 20, 20, 15 or I could have 20, 50, 50, 0 tens, I could have all 3 twenties or two 20s and a 50 or a 20 and two 50s. I could not have had all three 50s. I don't have enough for that. In how many ways can this be done? 5C3, which is 10. This is 5C2 into 3C1. 10 into 3, 30. 5C2 into 2C1. 10 into 2, 20. 5C1 into 3C2, 5 into 3, 15, 5C1 into 1, which is 5, 5 into 3 into 2, 30, 20, 20, 20, 3C3, one way, 20, 20, 50, 3C2 into 2, 3 into 2, 6, 20, 50, 50, 20 is 3 into 1, 3. Add all of this up. 3 plus 6 plus 1 is 10. Plus 20 is 30, 60, 80, 90, 120. Or we could have avoided all of this and then said, hey, what might 10 C3 be? 10 into 9 into 8. Why 1 into 2 into 3? Could have done that, but where's the joint in that? And so that is that. Right. Now we should have at least 90 rupees were taken out. So not this, not this. So 70, 50. This could work. 10, 20, 50 is only 80. Not this, not this. 20, 20, 50. This could work. This could work. 20, 50, 50. So 6 plus 3, 9. 9 plus 5, 14. 14 by 120, which is 7 by 60. Super tough question, you know, wonderful question. I, I I wanted to reconcile it. I wanted to see this. You could, you could, you could figure out that you cannot do it without uh, 50. So you need to have at least one 50 rupee note. You could have both 50 rupee notes and 10 and 20. Then two 50 rupee notes and 10 and, and 20. That's possible. Or one 50 rupee note, in which case other two will be 20 and 20. And then simplify it and, and get it divided by 120. I wanted to list everything down and see if it added up to 10 C3, which it did. Nicely enough, happily enough. So the total is 10 C3, which is 120. All of these combinations are possible. And then this turns out to be the answer.